Hello guys and uh, welcome to another video in uh, the XML uh, t video tutorials and uh, in this video I'm going to talk about uh, XSLT or um, extensible style sheet language uh, transformation okay uh, so first of all um, I want you guys to know that XSL um, is a language uh, is a uh, extensible styles sheet language okay uh, so is a language that was created to um, like CSS uh, was created for HTML XSL is, was created for the XML documents okay so we can uh, style um, the XML documents as we want with XSL um, but now uh, a new uh, uh, method appear and is the XSLT which means XSL um, extensible style sheet language transformation okay uh, so what it does it transforms um, the um, the style uh, to whatever um, type of document we want okay um, so I'm going to show you just uh, a little uh, example okay how to take a simple XML file and how to transform it to another type of file okay so before um, we start or um, okay let's just do the XML for first XML file so the first thing we have to do is create let's create some um, a list of albums as we did in the in the previous videos so a normal XML okay so to start we have to declare the XML um, version so XML version equals 1.0 and encoding we can type yes so and one which is the code this is the code for the general or the American English um, type of data and here catalog and here close catalog okay and here what we'll start is to put an album and close album okay so in here I'm going to type title and close title and artist and close artist and country and close country and let's say price and close price okay and um so let's continue let's copy this copy paste and let's do one more and paste so we would have three different albums now let's say Bob Marley oops uh, sorry Exodus Bob Marley Country Jamaica price nineteen ninety nine down here title black album Metallica Country USA price twenty and here let's type title uh Never mind. Nirvana. Country USA and price twenty two. Okay. Um, so we have now s three different albums in our catalog. Perfect. Let's save this. And now what I'm going to do is um, open a new file. And in this new file, 
I just have to type here, um, let's say XML. XML uh, version equals 1.0 encoding equals ESO and 8859 one close now XSL style sheet version equals 1.0 and uh, XML and namespace is going to be XSL equals to HTTP www and uh, w3 org 9999 xsl transform okay so this is the namespace for the um, xslt uh, or xsl file okay that we are creating now now xsl here prefix xsl template match equals this backslash and now here uh, what I'm going to do is type HTML and here body so as you might figure it out right now uh, I'm going to transform the um, basically the this XML file to um, uh, an XHTML file okay with all uh, the tags um, that an XHTML uh, should have and then present uh, this uh, albums in uh, an XHTML um, type of uh, output okay in our web in the in a web page okay so you'll see the result uh, in a minute so H2 and here my catalog and close H2 and I can put a table now table border equals 1 and here TR and TR BG color oops sorry uh, BG color equals to say nine uh, a nine a c d thirty two close this and now th close th inside it title and uh, th artist let me see title artist country and price artist and now just have to type in here uh, close TR and now we type uh, XSL and for each select and catalog oops catalog uh, CD and down here you can type TR and here TD and uh, XSL value uh, of select equals and title and close TD and here copy this
paste it and close TR. Title, title, it's not title here, is artist. Okay, down here, just have to type XSL for each and table and body and HTML and um, close XSL template and um, XSL style sheet finally okay uh, so it takes a little bit of work but um, it's good for your code practice okay so style sheet now let's save this as an XSL file so I'm going to uh, save this as catalog.xsl. Okay, let's save this. Catalog XSL. Now we have to do is to make here um, declaration to relate to the catalog XSL. Okay, um, so to do that, that's pretty easy. Just have to come up in here and type XML style sheet type equals uh, text XSL oops text XSL and uh, href equals um, catalog XSL okay so that's pretty much it. Let's save this and to open um, the file albums XML and see how XSL converts this um, this file presentation. We just have to run this in Chrome and let's see the result. Okay, we don't get nothing. The problem is Okay, the problem is that uh instead of album instead of sorry, here instead of a CD, we have to put here album. Sorry. So catalog album catalog album. Let's save this. Okay, so uh I found a, an error here which is uh you have to put the declaration XML at first line okay at the top page you have always to do that uh, I had this in my second line so you have to put it this uh, always at the top as well as your XML okay and down here as well I had um, a little space here in template so you don't you mustn't have any space there uh, either uh, in style sheet okay so save that Okay, so now we are ready to try uh, the XML file and transform it into XHTML file. To do that, just simply open the XML file in um, Firefox or Chrome or whatever browser you have. Normally, you have to uh, have a browser that supports XS, um, XSLT. Okay, um, in this case, I'm going to use. I tried Chrome, but my Chrome is uh, not um, updated, so I had to use Firefox. And if you use uh, an upgraded uh, version of Firefox that supports XLT, the result of this uh, transformation that we did with XSL is going to be uh, this one here. Okay? So the code, this is the code, uh, and if you see here, uh, at the bot at the at the top, if you see the file that we opened is albums.xml, but um, we did some transformation using XSL, 
um, or SSLT and this is the output that we have from our XML okay it's more presentable and we have some uh, little uh, background color in here and um, our uh, two columns with the artist and the title of the album okay guys so this is a pretty uh, simple example uh, how we can uh, transform files with XSLT and uh, you can go to uh, you can go to Web3 Schools or uh, search for some tutorials um, if you want to go deeper in uh, with XSLT. Okay, see you guys later, and don't forget to subscribe. Bye.